Before we get started on the next clip, yes, don't forget to like, subscribe, because every week we give away a free eBay account. Right, so if you've been suspended and you need to get back online again or you've got a problem, just contact me, it's free. Okay, so turn on notifications, you can't miss this, all right? In this video, I'm gonna go over a new feature that we've created. It's called RDP or Remote Desktop Protocol. Some of you may call it RDC for Remote Desktop Connection. Um, basically, it's a proxy for you to go through to access your accounts. So normally I have you go to the store that you wanna access this on, but in this case, it's not gonna be specific to a store. It's gonna be specific to your account. You'll see why in just a second. You'll just need to go to settings and go to fulfillment accounts. It's gonna be under your fulfillment accounts because each of your email addresses is going to be used to log in to those accounts on in my case on walmart overstock or amazon okay so for the remote desktop all you're going to do is click create here you're going to get a little pop-up and you're charged per day we're going to charge 32 cents per day for the accounts that need to use this so if you don't need to use it for three or four days or a week or 10 days or whatever you're not going to pay for those so i clicked create and then you're going to click ok and then you'll get a little green pop-up that shows up in the top right and you'll need to wait about 15 or 20 minutes for it to be completed and once it's done you'll be able to click connect so you can reset it or terminate it which is just going to delete the connection if you need to you'll need reboot if your server is ever stuck or if you go to it and it's frozen in the window that it opens up to reload it and restart it you'll lose all of your progress but you'll be able to work in it again and terminate is going to completely delete the server if your server becomes compromised or that ip address is compromised from your stealth account and you'll get a new ip address whenever you create a new one terminate is also how you'll end your billing so if you want to stop being billed for that remote desktop connection, you need to click terminate and that will stop the billing. And when you recreate it, it's going to begin your billing again. Um, but I'm just going to click connect and it's going to take me to a nice, just a new desktop. And from here, you'll be able to access everything that you need. And this is your own little virtual network to access your accounts. Now, I've tried this on my mobile, on my phone, and the phone won't actually detect this as a location to enter text and font. You might have some type of an on-screen accessibility app on your phone that will allow you to type stuff in. You could try that. I tried long pressing and hitting paste, but it still, it doesn't detect it as, as text. So I don't, I don't actually know if the on-screen keyboard feature will work or not. You guys might give me some, some tips on that or some comments below and let me know what your results are trying to do this with a mobile device okay so that's it the purpose of the rdp is so that you can access your account anonymously without compromising your stealth accounts on ebay amazon or walmart or whatever accounts that you're trying to stay anonymous on okay thanks again if this video was helpful please like and subscribe below if you're on your phone scroll down just a little bit below the video and subscribe please and we'll continue to put out more videos to help our dropshippers become more successful thanks again see you guys next time